Alrighty guys, what is up? Nighthawk DBZ here. Welcome back to another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. Today we're going to be taking on the Legends Goku event. And this time I'm going to be running with the transformation boost, but we're going to be mainly focusing on uh, Kid Buu here. Uh, he just got his EZA, and which, um, as you guys can see, I have him up to level 140. Super attack level up to 15 out of 15. I do have him 90% in the dupe system. So, um... I don't have no uh, skill orbs into him or anything like that. I figured I'd run him on a transformation booth to team mainly because it would give me a little bit of a better fighting chance on this team. And also because, oh, really, Kid Buu really doesn't have no good links. Um, obviously, you know, besides, you know, some, some of your normal links like Majin and stuff like that. Um, not that Big Bad Bosses is a good one. Uh, so I'm kind of... Figured I put run him on a pretty decent team, um, so we're gonna go over Kid Buu real quick. Go over all his new EZA stats, uh, his leader skill, you know, super attack, what it does, and stuff like that. And then we're gonna hop right into the legendary Goku event. So without further ado, let's go. All right, so he is an extreme intelligence type, key three HP attack and defense, 130 uh, percent. He does give super intelligence type key three HP attack and defense, 90 percent. Uh, he does have a super attack, which is Super Vanison Ball Extreme, uh, he do, uh, which uh, raises attack and defense for one turn. I wish he kind of did either greatly raise attack or at least stacked, but that's kind of fine. That's another reason why I kind of ran him on transformation boost. At least he'll have a, a better fighting chance. Uh, does cause immense damage to the enemy and recovers 12% uh, HP. Um, I don't really have this Kid Boo built as... Uh, for combo attacks, I have him more built for um, critical attacks, uh, but he, since he does have a level 6 combo attack, hopefully he does have a good chance of performing a second attack. Uh, Pass the skill, uh, which is single mind, mind this, mind it, miss, the miss, um, attack 100%, plus an additional attack and defend 70% when HP is 30% or more. Uh, Majin Power Category Extreme Class Allies do get uh, plus one key when HP is 50% or more. And any Extreme Class Allies get key plus one when HP is 70% or more. Uh, so that's kind of good. Uh, he does give at least one key to all Majin, uh, Majin Power Categories and also um, Extreme any extreme class allies. I kind of wish they kind of gave him like two. I think it would have been a little bit better since, um, you know, Kid Buu doesn't really have a good link set with with too much any characters. Uh, so, you know, we'll just have to see how that plays out. Uh, like I said, I'm going to try to keep Kid Buu on the front rotation. I think I'm going to try to keep him with um, hopefully a good unit here. I did ran the um, Janimba uh, mainly because he's a Good defender, really good defender. I have him, well, he's actually supposed to be 90%, but he's 89%, so I miss one. Uh, I did brought uh, Golden Freezer here, uh, also a really good defender um, when, you know, of course, when the HP is at a certain percent of a threshold. Uh, hopefully, we don't not fall below that. Um, I brought um, Majibu. Uh, Gohan Absorb, uh, mainly because of his healing ab ability, and hopefully that would also help us out as well, and for me um, to uh, get my health up, where I won't really have to use too many healing items. Um, we also, of course, we have the Big Daddy Cooler. We cannot forget about Cooler here. I brought the friend one, who's 100%. Mine one, uh, which I only have 1% in the dupe system. None in the dupe system, actually. Yeah, he's only 55%. Uh, he's going to be a big, tremendous help. I also brought this boo, uh, Super Boo. Uh, he's, I don't think he's going to be really too, like, really any good here. Uh, he is 100%. Uh, but hopefully I can get a good transformation off him. Either Ultimate uh, Gohan Absorb, which he greatly raises his attack and defense for one turn. Uh, he does, say, you know, recover HP at the start of battle and stuff like that. That could be pretty helpful. Or if we can get him to have uh, Piccolo absorb, uh, he does greatly re raises his defense for one turn. Uh, but they only happen when we hit a certain threshold in the health bar. So hopefully um, I can get the right one, which can possibly help me out throughout the fight. All right. So I, the only problem is I don't have no physical units. 
So I'm going to have a bit of a struggle here. Um, so without further ado, let's jump in and let's see how well we do. About five minutes in, which is pretty good. All right. So see you guys link up perfectly. So I think that's how we're going to do it No, Yeah, I think this is how we're going to do it. We're going to let Janimpa tank that. I'm going to try to keep... Problem is, I got to try to at least keep two, purp two purple or at least four key spheres. And of course, Janimpa, Janimpa dodges, which is going to be really helpful. And hopefully we can get a lot of dodges off. I don't really expect um, Buhan to really do too much damage. I mean, since he is like, you know, he did, did get the second super attack off, which is really good. And at least it's good because he lowers the uh, attack and defense and all that other stuff early. But once I believe, I mean, I've done the stage so many times. That's a good amount of damage. 2.6 on a crit. Um, I believe once we get to Super Saiyan God, I think that's when none of that really matters anymore. All right, so we're going to keep, for the time being, I'm going to keep Golden Freezer. Well, not for the time being. I'm definitely keeping Golden Freezer and Cooler together, mainly because they're, like, really good linking partners, obviously. And I'm going to try to keep the other, my Cooler, I might keep mine. See if I can link him up with Kid Boo. See if he has any good, any type of good links with Kid Boo. I mean, we'll see. One point nine on a crit. Like I said, I don't expect this boo to do too much, but he's gonna be mainly the off rotation on you know we'll see from there. Alright, so we are getting a transformation right off the bat, which is good. Alright, so it looks like nobody really links up good with you know definitely Boo Han and uh, Janimpa definitely have the good links. All right, so we're going to transform with Cooler. Because this Cooler is definitely going to be the hardest hitting unit in this um, event right now. And I'd rather have, that's another reason, like I said, I ran him on his team. He's a good hard hitting unit. Right, let's see if I can drop these down right now. Just want to try to set up for uh, Boo, which... Kid Boo, which it doesn't look like it's going to happen like that. So I really got to be cautious on my key here. Alright, so that's an easy uh, kill right there. Hmm. Got a good amount of key right here. Well, that's because that's right. It's cooler's uh, passive, actually. So we're gonna transform with this one. I'm throwing Majin uh, Kid Buu off rotation one more time because I want to try to get him in the next rotation. Uh, this rotation is strictly for uh, cooler and Frieza. So I should have probably kept uh, Boo first, but I wasn't thinking. That was my bad. All right, we're actually going to grab these purple ones. I don't think we're going to... I think Cooler might do some damage because this is the friend one who is 100%. 12,000... 100, 121,000. Not too bad, actually. Well, you could always expect your 100% cooler, you know, to do some damage. Oh, and before I do forget, I'm probably going to try to talk about this at the end of the video, but I'm going to get it done and over with now. Um, uh, We do got the LR Jiren banner, uh, which uh, I haven't looked yet, but it should definitely be live right now. Oh, we are getting a transformation. Cool. So we're getting a, a Gohan Absorb right off the bat. Good, good, good. Um, So like I was saying was that Jiren's banner should be live. I am not summoning on that banner. 
I'm definitely not summoning on that banner. Reasons why I kind of want to save my stones. I want to try to save uh, my stones up for a whatever uh, big time unit that comes our way. So I figured I'm going to save up. But uh, in the Baba Shop, there is some pretty good units actually in the Baba Shop. And I'm actually thinking about spending my gold coins on either. I'm um, thinking about going for uh, the LR uh, Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, or I might go for the Goku Black. I'm not 100% sure yet how I'm going to do that. I'm kind of leaning more towards Vegeta because, you know, I'm more of a Vegeta fan. But I don't know yet. So I'm going to take some time and I'm going to look at that later. But I'm definitely, and also um, uh, Topo and Dispo. Got it, uh, easy A. So expect that video coming out as well. I am going to be getting them, um, trying to get them done tonight and hopefully have a video within the next few days. I do got a couple other videos scheduled out and ready to go. So they might come out just a little bit later. Um, going to try to hope for maybe the, um, the weekend, maybe, um, probably like the latest, maybe Sunday. I know that's kind of a drag. But like I said, I got I, depends on my video schedule how it goes. Ooh, 204. That's quite a bit of damage, actually. All right, so ooh, man, the key here is just ugly. Oh my god. Okay, all right. All right. We're gonna like so I gotta I'm gonna need quite a bit of key here. Maybe I should have um Kept one of the coolers from transforming. And what I should have done was I could have, should have kept that one on and off rotation to keep the good key um, floating around. That that would have been probably a smarter idea in which I did not. But as you guys can see here without no healing items, Kid Boo is tanking pretty good on a basic attack. Um, we'll definitely have to see how he does well after a super attack. Of course, you can always count on Cooler to do the damage for you. Alright, we're on Super Saiyan God now. It's going to start getting a bit intense. So I got to try to save as many intelligent orbs as I can right now. So we're in a bit of a bind here. The more... Um, okay, I should not take barely any damage here. I should take a good chunk, but not too much. 30,000. That's what I like to see. But yeah, so pretty much um, I got to try to at least save three purple key spheres or more. So I'm I'm sitting bad with boost. Definitely sitting bad with key right now. That's why it's like kind of wish that they they definitely need these should have gave like a support Majin unit. And I think they do. Actually, I think they do. I'm I'm going to have to look that up real quick. Hold up while we're doing this. I believe there was one Majin unit. I think one Majin unit that was actually a support. All right, how's that look? Thirty. You know what? He does link up way better with um with Buhan. He definitely gets some good links. But I'd rather keep, um, ooh, Dogon attack. That's actually going to be good right there. Hold on. Put down the phone for a second. Okay. So let's see how well he does on a, um, on a Dogon attack. And let's hope that we can get all seven of them. I missed two. Not, that's, that's fine. I'm going to say if he crits. About three million if he crits. If he doesn't crit, I'm gonna say it's about a could be a two million attack right here. Four point five million on a crit with type advantage. That's pretty good. I mean, there's I mean we seen better and higher numbers, but that's pretty that's pretty good for Bo. Oh, man, I really don't like Janimba being a floater here. I really don't like him being a floater, but that's, I mean, got to do what you got to do, right? I'm going to try to save those. 
I don't have really too much to worry about, Janumpa. Because as of right now, the real fight is starting right now because, you know, it's we're getting into the higher stages, so... This, I don't think it's going to hurt. I really don't think that's going to hurt. I'll be really surprised. That's nah, 12,000. That's nothing. Cooler, on the other hand, is going to be doing a hell of a lot of damage. 2.1 on a crit, man. Awesome. And he's still critting, which is really... That's why, I, like I said, a thousand times now, that's why I like bringing this team. It works with the transformation boost, with Cooler... I just wish that, you know, this Kid Boo was like the um, the physical Kid Boo. You know, that's kind of what I really uh, wish for. If he kind of had a bit of, like, the, um, uh, the passive skill like him, I mean, I think we would have been pretty good. 50,000 on a basic hit, though. That's a lot of damage. At least he got the dodge off. 3.3 attacks that... How much can he hit for, Boo? At least we're getting that 12% HP boost. 1.3. Now we are now on a basic hit, as you guys can see. He took less. 5,000. That's that's the numbers I like seeing. And Cooler's still going to crit and put up those numbers. So, got to love Cooler. You got to love passes where they can actually shine on like certain events. And you're taking 50,000 damage now. Jesus. Man, everybody's taking 50,000 damage. Problem is, I think I may have lost uh, Freeze's support. I think I did. I hope not, but I think I did. All right, now... Hmm. You know what? I'm going to use a Princess Snake right here. Yep. I think that might be the best thing to do. And I'm going to try to get set up for the next turn. And Cooler's, he's just going to crit. So I have nothing to worry about with Cooler. 2.1. Awesome. Already on Ultra Instinct. And so far his, you know, defense is, you know, 76,000. You know, it's not the best, but his attack's pretty good. Hmm. And, well, this actually just kind of just messed me up a little bit. So. Hmm. I need at least four. If I can drop those right, it's only gonna give me three. Son of a bitch. Oh well, looks like Boo's not gonna get off his his uh, super attack, which is fine. That's nice, but um, we're gonna try to save that. All right. Well, at least I got um the Weiss on. At least the Whis is on. At least we're getting a little bit of protection there. And hopefully uh, Kid Boo can actually dodge or even perform a second super attack. If he can get a second super attack off, that would be awesome. Well, no second super attack. He did get a crit on a basic attack. Can you dodge Boo? See, I gotta... I Probably start throwing on skill orbs all my items. You know, the, um, not skill orbs all my items. Uh, the, um, um, I can't even think of the name now. All right, we're definitely saving those. Um, shit, dude. The little skill, um, the skill things that I can't think of the name. It's definitely. I don't know. It's just today. Today's been a weird day for me.
Also, let me know down in the comment section below, guys, if you guys are going for Jiren. So if you made it this far into the video, honestly, thank you. I appreciate that you guys actually managed to sit down and managed to watch my videos and like them. But if you guys didn't make it this far into the video, be sure to let me know down in the comment section below if you guys are going for LR Jiren. And if you are, how many copies are you going for um, just going for one copy of him and that's it you're done or you're gonna try to go for at least a good a good um or you're gonna try to 100 percent him that's gonna help us out a little bit oh i kind of messed cooler up there but that's that's fine could i bring those down right there we go weiss is still active we got a little bit we definitely got some heals right there Eighty-eight thousand on a basic hit dude that is insane that is definitely insane for Kid Boo, man. Imagine on Ultra Instinct stage. Now we'll see how much he takes. 37. So he still takes a lot of damage, actually. Even, even by getting one super off, he still takes quite a bit of damage. I think I might die here. Seventy-nine. Dude, I nearly died. Holy shit. Well, we definitely lost... Um, we definitely lost Freeze's passive right there. We, we definitely did. So that's why I said, you know what? I'm throwing up the... Um, uh, the Usher and stuff. So, um, hmm... I think if this keeps up, I might not be able to survive uh, Ultra Instinct. So I think what it might be time to do is maybe take Kid Buu off the rotation. Honestly, I think that might be the best idea here just to finish out the stage. Because this is literally... This is the big boy stage right here. This is definitely the big boy stage. And I don't think Kid Boo is going to be able to survive this stage one bit. Hmm. But we'll, we'll see. We'll see here if he can. Um, if he can at least put up some good numbers, I might keep him, like, until Janimpa comes back. I think that's the game plan. I think I'm going to try to get cooler with Janimpa. And then just kind of keep Kid Boo on the back burner. If Kid Boo had more of a stacking type ability, I think it would have been a lot easier for Kid Boo. And we got dodged. See, even with the help with the Weiss, I mean, double digits. This is all right. Well, this is where we need to see it. Can Kid Boo take a super attack with a Weiss? 131, I mean, it's 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 basic, but it ain't the best. Like I said, the the Weiss, and I think if the Aider is still active, that's what's kind of keeping us alive right now. That's the definite what's keeping us alive here. All right, get back to heals. So we lost Aider. So now it, sh it should be simply just... The weeks that's active. So far, so good. Right now, Cooler is the big shot. So Cooler has to do all the damage here. Come on, just crit. Like 3 million crit, right? 2.3, not bad. We definitely got to get another Dokkan attack. Oh, four attacks, baby. Let's... Oh, wait, that's three attacks. Two supers. One basic. Come on, four million. Two point four, not bad. All right, Buhan. I know you're not going to do anything here, but hopefully, that's a lot of damage, even with a Weiss active. That was a lot of damage, actually. All right. Aider, once again, it's getting chaotic. 
All right, sorry, boo, I got to do this to you, but you are going to have to go off rotation. I don't think that's going to hurt too bad. I got the Aider, and Janimpa's a pretty good blocker, so I'm going to say about 50,000. Nope, that was still a lot of damage, actually. And I already know Mons ain't going to do that much. 1.7. The more attacks that I can get off with Cooler, the better off I am. Ah, uh, boo, boo, boo. Man, if you were if you were like the uh, the physical boo, man, he would have done tremendous. Because that's what I used the last time. I used the intelligence boo, and I did pretty damn good on this stage, actually. I think I beat it relatively quick. And I'm losing a lot of health. Honestly, I'm about to usher it, honestly. But I think I'm going to let Cooler take it. Just to kind of keep Frieza alive, I think I'm going to let Cooler take it. Because Cooler would be able to tank better than Frieza right now. Because I think, like I said, Frieza should have just lost passive with how low my health just was. Alright, yeah, there goes that dodge. Dodging again. Goku with all his dodges, dude. That would have been like three freaking super attacks on him. That would have killed him instantly. There goes that super attack. I knew I was I knew it was gonna happen. I just didn't know where. Uh that's gonna be like 200. Yep. Alright, well. Sorry to say, but we're beating the stage here. So, last healing item. We are beating the stage here. I hate to say it, but we are beating... We're beating it here with Janimpa. Janimpa, 2 million damage on a Dokkan attack. Let's go. Critical. So, yeah, honestly, I mean, for Kid Boo, I mean, I don't, he's definitely not built for the for the legendary Goku. I don't think. I mean, I think if maybe if I ran him on Majin Power with the, um, oh, well, Kid Boo didn't even kill him. Um, if I ran him with the, um, with the LR Boo Go Tanks Absorb, I could have probably did a, a hell of a lot better with Kid Boo, but. I think since he was on transformation boost, you know, he wasn't really at his potential, I would say. So maybe if I could pull that LR um, Go Tanks Absorb Boo, I should probably do a little bit better. But without further ado, guys, I really hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, be sure to smash the like button and don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay. Uh, and hit the notification bell to always stay notified when I upload new videos. I do plan to upload uh, new videos daily. Uh, whether if it's Dokkan or any other game I do play on my channel. Uh, other than that, like I said, hopefully you guys did enjoy. Uh, be safe out there. Have a good one. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. All right. Later.